Well, hello. It's night three of Making Christmas Count workshops. You've made it. You made it through the third night. I know a lot of you have done a lot of the challenges and a lot of the different questions and answers and some of the planning, which is great. This is just going to make your business stronger and stronger. It's going to help you and you'll be able to use this in the future. So it's very exciting. So I want to congratulate all of you for making it through the three nights. I'm excited that you chose to be here with us and we're gonna get started as we spend this night celebrating the end of our workshops and now it comes to the implementation time. So let me go ahead and share my screen with you and we will, um, we will start the process. So let me go ahead and click this into present mode so you can see the full screen and not all my other little things on here. And there we go. And so, as I said, you should be very proud of yourselves for being a part of this workshop all day or the last three days. And it's just way to go. Pat yourself on the back. You deserve it. Anytime you take some lessons to work for your business, it's a good thing. Yes, we all work in our business doing the day to day tasks. But this, taking these classes and working on the marketing side, this is working for your business. This will grow your business and it's a time to celebrate. And we really hope that this Christmas counts well for you when it comes to the profit and revenue. So as we talked last night, we encouraged you to think about long-term rentals. And on our worksheet and stuff, we were teaching you how to figure out what is the value that you need to price for your rentals. And so what we've done now is we posted the order form. If you'd like to buy one of our kits, you don't have to. We hope you do. We hope you want to be a part of our whole program. But what we did is we went in and we think the Trio Pathway Kit is going to be the most popular because one, your customers will get a choice out of the three different items which they'd like. So what we did is we went in and we took the exact formula that we gave you last night to know your value and we filled in the numbers. So I'm going to quickly go through this since we taught this last night and if you need help you can either ask me questions or you can revisit unit two on the Facebook group. But our true TRIO pathway set is going to be $345. This gives you enough to set up three houses at one time. Um, if you have to buy steaks, you'll need approximately 30 for these three setups. So we figured out for ours, we looked at our pricing. We usually buy ours from Dirt Cheap Signs. They don't know us from a hole in the wall, but they service us well and it makes us happy. And then we always add $5 to every setup because you never know when we're going to have to buy bug killer or new wipes to wipe down the signs or anything like that. There's always little odds and expenses that you're buying. And so we just throw a $5 fee onto each one. So since this is three houses, you can see we added 15. If we don't use it all in the long run, that becomes part of your profit, but it's a good thing to look at. So what we normally do is our grand total came to 408. Normally you would add in your expenses, like your insurance, if you have um, any type of loans out there, you would put that in there. But right now for us, we've been really going slimline and we have paid off everything for the year. So December is strictly going to be the cost of our signs and the placement. So that's why we don't have it on here. We take it out. We actually divide ours up and take it out in 10 months so that November and December hopefully is strictly in the black for us. We both come from a retail background and you want all your expenses covered by October and then you want November and December to be your gravy month. So that's how we still work. It's the retail in us. So you're gonna take your 408 total, which is what we're estimating we're gonna pay out. We have three setups, divide that by three. So for us to break even for each one of these houses that we're gonna set up at, we must charge at least $136. That just puts us dead even. Doesn't pay for any labor or anything like that, just makes us dead even. So then you go down here, as I had mentioned last night, Tina and I, we try to aim for 60% profit on each job we do. So we take that 136, we multiply it by 60%, it comes out to 82. It does come out to 81 and change, but who wants to do a change? So we round up. 
So then we take this 82 and we add it to the 136 and it gives us now that our amount that we should be charging at the bare minimum to break even and get our 60% profit is $218. But as you can see, nowhere is in our labor is included in this number. So we feel that each setup we do takes us approximately three hours. One hour of in dealing with the customer, making sure payments have been made, processing the order and scheduling our time. And then whoever goes and sets it up, we do it at a minimum of one hour. We try to stay within five miles of either my house or Tina's house. So usually an hour should be more than enough time unless the ground's really hard or some crazy thing like that. So we do that, we do an hour for setup and then we do an hour for tear down and usually tear down is much quicker. So we always add three hours and we like to make $30 an hour. So you can see here then we added in this $90 which represents our hourly fee for our labor. So the grand total amount that we wanna charge for our long-term rentals is $308. So that will make us make the profit we want, cover all our fees, and let us get paid for the time that we worked. But of course, you play with the numbers, you see what the market bears, and since we're going for a long-term rental, we decided to up this a little bit. Now, if you look at this one, I want a cookie. This is part of the numbers that we showed there. So as you can see, we are charging $345 for the long-term rental. And we're telling people that from the time you rent until approximately December 27th, the fee is going to be $345. And we're going to work with the clients and let them know that we will have this display put up within three to four days. So the earlier you order, the earlier you get with us, the longer time you're going to get for that 345. Now, if you call us on December 10th and you want to have us do a display from December 11th through the 27th, great, still going to be 345. We're not going to lower that rate up and down. Our price is our price. And um, so for us, as we get closer to Christmas, it's just a different thing um, on keeping our price the same for everyone. And the sooner they call, the sooner the better deal they'll actually get. So you can see we created for each one of the sets that we have the, for the trio. We, the one you just saw was the gingerbread. Then we have the candy canes and the ornaments. And again, all three of them are priced at $345 with that same thing of rent now through December 27th. And you get it for $345. And then also down here, we have priced out at Home Depot um, spotlights. And right now they're all on sale and out there because everybody wants to put spotlights on their house for the holidays. So it's a good time to buy spotlights for you if you can use them all year round, which we try to do. We ask our homeowners if they would like lights, if they have electric available, and we charge a fee of $38 and we bring lights with us. So if that's something you want to you know, think about doing, it's an add-on, gives you a little more money coming into your pocket. And if you buy all your spotlights now during the Christmas season, you can use them all year round. And they're much cheaper than if you go to buy a spotlight, say in March or April. I don't know why they go up, but they do. So now we want to talk a little bit about our step by step guide. This is a guide that Tina and I have put together over the many years we've worked together. We used to run, um, we used to manage malls and we ran the largest Santa set in South Florida. We did more than $350,000 in Santa photo sales. It was crazy, that line never ended. So we've created this guidebook, which we've been using now for so many years, and we've added so much to it. When we started, we didn't have social media and we didn't have all these other things. And then plus, once we started running our own business, we had the capability of adding things like fundraising and all sorts of things that are our ideas that we would never use at the mall. So we're excited. It's right now, it's over 32 pages for this guidebook and it has everything we've talked about. And so we really hope you consider using this guidebook, whether or not you buy our sheets and our kits or not. If you buy a kit, the step-by-step -step guidebook comes with each one. 
if you have already purchased your sheets and you already have your holiday planning done for what you're going to use and you just want to buy the guidebook, you can go to our order form and you can buy just the guidebook for $18. There's so much information in there. It should be way more than 18, but that's what we're pricing it at because we want to be able to help everyone. And we really are showing you the systems, the processes on things to follow, and just so many different things. And if there's something that's not in there that you ask us about, we're gonna look it up, we're gonna find out you know, about it, and then we will also add it to the book. So if you want to get just the guidebook, feel free. If not, you can go ahead and get it complimentary with the kits. This guidebook will come to you via email, it's all digital. So you can save it on your computer and also use it for future holidays and different things. So although it's set for Christmas and the feel and the theme of all the artwork and stuff is Christmassy, there's no reason to say you can't delete the word Christmas and put Valentine's Day in and follow everything the same way for another holiday. So one of the things we've done is we used to work with a printer locally here in South Florida. We'd have them print all our signs and everything that we do for these workshops. Then Tina and I would sort them, pack them. We'd go to the post office or UPS and we'd ship them all out. And it was a lot of work. It would take us two to three days just to do that. And um, it, it was a lot more work on us than what we thought. And just the shipping cost, because we don't have a program with UPS or FedEx or any of those, our shipping costs were higher. So th this time we've talked to our friends at Yard Card Depot and they are going to print for us the sheets and they're gonna drop ship them straight from the printer to your house. So you will get that much faster than it coming for Tina and I to sort and do it. Like I said, it would take us three or four days after we've waited four days for the printer to print everything. So this is really going to speed it up. And in working with Yard Card Depot, we have decided to give everyone a gift who purchases $100 or more with our programs. And it's going to be a holiday business sign. Tina and I were looking at our business sign and we thought it was too birthday oriented. So we were thinking of ways to come up with a Christmas theme business sign that still gives out our information. And so we came up with just this one that says Merry Christmas. It matches the themes if you look at the artwork. And then you can have your name typed here or you can have your logo and then either your website or phone number, however it is that you want customers to reach you. Tina and I are striving really hard to try to make everybody go to our website. So we're actually taking our phone number off our business signs because we want them to go right to our website to order on there. And if they need us, they can find our um, phone numbers on the website. So this is just something that's there. So if you place your order and it's $100 or more, you'll get this complimentary 11 by 11 sign. And if you send us your logo in either a vector format or a PNG transparent at the time you place the order, then we will utilize your logo in this sign instead of type. But unfortunately, it's too it's too difficult for us to hunt people down and find them and wait for their logos and different things. So you have to send that in when you place your order and we can take care of that for you. If not, it will be typed out very similar to how I have my business name typed here and um, be ready to go. And again, we're really happy that Yard Card is joining us as our printing partner. So these are the kits that we're offering in our setup and all this art on the top has been specially made for this program. You're not gonna find it on Yard Card Depot. You can't go to them and buy it directly. You have to buy it through us. We're trying to keep it a little more exclusive and we have this design for us. And first we have the gingerbread um, set. This is for the pathway and we have three boys and three girls in our little set, it comes with the large Merry Christmas flash. Then it comes with a smaller flash that says, love was born on Christmas day. And then you'll get your business sign that says Merry Christmas with your sign in there. So it's, it's a really nice set. And then we also have the candy cane. You get eight candy canes. You get this Merry Christmas flash. Same thing with the two down here. And then we have our six piece Christmas ornament and you get the additional flashes um, with that also. 
Then we have our large nativity scene, which is really two sheets combined together. So you'll notice that when we're selling our large nativity scene, it's a much, not much higher, but it is a higher price than um, our one sign. So you'll see that that's different. And then we have our small nativity scene, which is one. Now it doesn't fit on the sheet to show you here, but with the small nativity scene, you will get a business sign and you'll also get this love was born on Christmas day flash with it. We just can't show it on there. We'll be printing those separate for you. So we have a lot of kit options and the order form now is up in the group in unit, I believe it's unit three. You can see the order form there, but these are the prices that we have up. And again, we have a large Christmas kit. Now this Christmas kit, you can set up five yards at once and it comes with all of them. So you're gonna get the nativity, you're gonna get the candy cane, you're gonna get the ornaments, the gingerbread, all of the flashes and the business signs. And all that together is $552. And if you order by November 28th, which is Small Business Saturday, you'll get free shipping. So that is a perk that we're giving you right now that you'll be able to get free shipping. And that's a lot. You got to figure that's five sheets and additional sheets for the flashes. So that's going to be a big shipment if you get that. But you should be able to actually have it in five different yards. And if you look at the presentation we did last night and you look at Know Your Value, we actually were doing the breakdown of the cost for this. And since now we partnered with Yard Card Depot, we were able to trim this number down. If you look at the Know Your Value from last night, it is marked at $582, but working with Yard Card Depot, we're able to reduce that down. So it's just another great perk on working with them. So then you can buy the small nativity set on its own, which is 135, which also comes with the guidebook and the flash and stuff. And then the large nativity set, which is the two sheets that you saw in the picture above here for this is the large and this is the small. Then we've also broken down the kits by setting them up in groups of three. We felt you needed to have three so that you could sell more than one and leave them out for multiple times. So each kit that you see here is a group of three. So if you're gonna buy the candy cane, it's actually three different setups. So three different houses for the 345. And again, if you order before November 28th, you get free shipping. Same thing with the ornaments and the gingerbread. Then we decided to make a trio pathway kit. And what this is, this is one of the candy cane, one of the gingerbread and one of the ornaments. So if you would like to showcase all three of them and let your customers pick, it's a great option on that. So we really think this trio is gonna be popular because it will have all of them. Again, it's 345. And if you order before November 28th, it's free shipping. Then we decided that some of you might, this might be too big of a bite for you to take all at once and you don't know if it's gonna sell or not. So we decided to go ahead and make a single pathway. And so you can buy just deck the halls for the 135. You can buy just the gingerbread or just the, um, whoop, this says trio, but this really should say candy cane, sorry. I'll change that. Um, so you get these for the 135. You also get the step-by-step -step guide. You'd also get the business sign and the flashes. So that's a, it's still a very good deal for everything that you're getting. It's still a great price. And then you can see how quickly you sell it. And if you sell it quickly, you can reorder. Then in our step-by-step -step guide, one of the things that we're gonna show you in there is exactly how to plan your promotion. And we've given you a little sneak peek here where we're gonna give you a timeline of what Tina and I are following. Like this week, you need to determine how you're gonna do this. Are you gonna work on the fundraising? Are you gonna work on the long-term? Or are you gonna just keep it as a one night? Whichever idea you decide to do, it's perfect. There's no right or wrong. It's your business. It's how you want to run it. And that's the best part about owning your own business. You don't have to do it the way someone else tells you. So you need to really determine now, because if you want to order and get the free shipping, you definitely want to order before November 28th. You also want to think about Black Friday. Black Friday is one of the busiest shopping days of the year. 
going out to malls and different things, but that's not to say you can't have different yard displays up or reach out. We're gonna do an email campaign to all our previous customers, whether it's for balloons, photo booths, yard cards, and our marketing customers, and we're gonna offer a special for them. These are gonna be our repeat customers that we really like already. We know they pay the bills. So we're gonna reach out and give them a great deal via email, and hopefully they'll buy on Black Friday. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna kind of force the issue with that, and we're gonna give them a great rate. We're gonna give them 50% off, anything they order for 2021, but they must order it on Black Friday or by Black Friday, which is November 27th, and they will have to pay for it by November 27th. Now, the trick with that, because of what's going on with COVID and everything, and you don't know if things are gonna cancel, I encourage you not to touch that money until you've completed the event. So it will help you because if you have it in your bank account, you can grow interest on it, but make sure you keep that there. So if we get put back in a lockdown, say in April, and you have to cancel all your April Easter setups or your Easter photo booths or balloon displays, you have that money in your account to give back. So you're not trying to figure out where that money is going to come from in April. Also too, on Cyber Monday, we're gonna do the exact same sale that we're doing on Black Friday, but we're gonna open it up to the public and we're gonna give a smaller discount. So we're giving 50% off to our returning customers on Black Friday. We're probably gonna give 35% off to new customers that reach out and the same thing. They have to pay on that Cyber Monday, place their order on that Cyber Monday, and then we will monitor it. And I know it sounds like a big discount, However, if we can get 10 or 15 orders on this day, that's gonna last us all the way through 2021, it helps us with our planning and our budgeting and everything. And it's just a nice base. And we'll still continue to market and push forward like we always do, but it gives you a nice base. And if you think about it on, it's better for the airlines to sell an inexpensive plane ticket the day the plane's leaving than to let that seats that they're empty. So for us, we'd rather give away a yard sign display or a balloon display, less money, but it guarantees us money coming in on that day. The other thing we're going to show you is we're going to encourage you to create a whole month worth of social media content. So you're not having to think about it when you're busy and doing all these different things in December, because we know you have to Christmas shop and plan your meals and do everything else in addition to run your business. So we're going to give you a list of content. We're going to give you some samples. All these different things come in this step-by-step -step guide. And again, you're welcome to tweak them as much as you want, change them up, do different things. So the promotional plan, this is just like a little sneak peek teaser for you. Um, we'll have a lot more in there, taking you all the way through the program, including wrapping up with hopefully getting surveys from your customers on what they liked and what they didn't like. And if you get raving reviews from them on the survey, we're gonna ask them then to post a review on Google or Yelp or any of those, even your Facebook page so that you can utilize that in the future. So again, this is the exact same page as last night for social media, but it's so important. So again, we just want you to really look at your social media and in the step-by-step -step guidebook, we're actually gonna give you some websites you can go to, put in your website information and they actually grade your website. But the cool thing is when they grade them, they tell you what's wrong. So if your phone number on Google My Business, if it's different than your phone number on Apple Maps, it's gonna ask you, which one's right? Why don't they match? And if five out of six of your sites match the phone number and just Google My Business is wrong, it's gonna tell you. So that will save you time too, because then you can go to Google My Business, you know it's gotta be something funky with the phone number, you can go in and check and if you, you know, made a typo, you can correct that. So we left this page just because it's so important. Then, as I had mentioned earlier, we made a partnership for this program with Yard Card Depot. We're very excited that Dustin's coming on board and I wanted to give you all their contact information. If you're not following them on Facebook, I highly encourage you to. They do all these different specials and sales at different times. Every Wednesday, they change their sales. So, Today, they have a $65 sheet, which is always one that they pick. 
And then they also pick a number of other sheets that they do for $75. So it's a really good deal. So Wednesday's when you wanna check them out, see what they have on sale and look at it. Now the items that we're working with, the nativity set and these here, they're not gonna be on sale. So don't try to wait a couple of days or a couple of weeks to see if those pop up on sale. He's not gonna put those on sale because they're an exclusive for this part. The small nativity scene you can get on his program, but it is full price and you don't get the step-by-step -step guide. You don't get the nice flash with it and you also don't get the business sign. So although our prices are a little bit higher, you are getting a lot more bang for your buck on that. So, um, so again, I'm just really happy that you have participated with us on these three nights of this workshop. I can't wait to see what you have. If you, you know, like what I've been teaching you, I hope you've joined our entrepreneurial Elevate Your Skills. That is our private Facebook group where we teach a lot of things for small business um, or for yard carters directly. We have yard cards, grow my business. You're welcome to join that too. We're gonna to be constantly doing different classes from everything from, finances, to marketing, to all sorts of things. And if there's something you want us to help you with, send us a note and we'll check into it. Chances are between Tina and I, we've probably presented the class or done something with it and just lots of exciting things. And we're hoping that you just look at your business at the end of this class and try to think of ways to diversify by going into the long term going into the fun right sorry fundraising programs and stuff which all our details are going to be in your step by step guide so if you're like oh she really didn't go over the fundraising it's in there i just don't have the time to go over every little thing in these sessions so again thank you so much for joining us if you like us and you're watching this on youtube i hope you like our channel i hope you click us a like on the video um, we're just very excited and we're, we're really here to help and we enjoy this. We've mostly focused on small restaurants and small retailers. So it's just fun and exciting to get out and to do um, this with ballooners and yard carters and photo booth companies and stuff. So again, thanks for joining us. Congratulations for working for your business and just building it up. We're really happy that you've joined that. And if you have any questions, we'll see you in the Making Christmas Count. Facebook group. Thank you. Bye-bye.